Did you want to come and see all the good folks that showed up tonight? Light them up! I knew that I always wanted it to be a part of my life. I had no idea it was going to be this integral. It always felt right standing on stage and performing for people. Hannah was the quintessential sleepy little farm town. Because there's not much going on, it's really easy to get in trouble. I was a bad kid. He was either on his way to it or from it. I think the cops really wanted to get me out of this town. <laughs> that, I can, that I can tell you. I'm glad he got into music. <laughs> Ryan played the guitar. That's where the, the common ground was. Four guys in a van that shouldn't have made it two miles, and they were living the dream. In the 2000s, there wasn't a band on the planet that got more radio airplay than Nickelback. How You Remind Me has been considered one of America's most played songs ever. All of that exposure triggered a reaction. Why does everybody hate Nickelback? Nickel bad, Nickel hack, Nickel bomb, Nickel creed. Nobody picks up a guitar to be in the most hated band in the world. They were part of cancel culture before we had a name for it. It's kind of just like a long running meme. They became the most hated band in music. We try and laugh it off. You can, you can laugh off about 90% of it, and some of it, it hurts. The complaints about Nickelback aren't unusual. Their songs are formulaic. But I think sometimes people want to hear vacuous, dumb shit. He's an amazing front man, you know? He's a badass. I've always felt a sense of loneliness about Chad. I don't have an identity without this band. This is going to be tough to talk about. I'm not in Nickelback anymore. OK, I quit. They mean so much to each other. They've grown up together. The chemistry is real. It's palpable. To those of you who um, see this band as some big corporate sellout, um, fuck you. Everybody's got an opinion about them. Nickelback, fan or liar? I play Nickelback songs to Nickelback fans. So I don't have to go and try and win over someone who doesn't like my band. That sounds like a, some very strange form of torture. Um, for probably for both of us. <laughs>